I'm Van, he's still Derek. You can always tell when it's May in Wisconsin. You can't see because of all of the pollen in the air, <laughs> and you can't breathe because of all of the pollen in the air, and your, your allergies are going way out of control. But we're in control here because it is May, and we have a very active month in front of us. And I tell you, it would be nice if we got a little rain to get the pollen out of the air. It would be really <laughs> nice. They keep showing us that it's coming, but it doesn't seem like it is. So welcome, everybody. You know, uh, for those that have been here for years and all of our new members, I cannot tell you enough. Pay attention to the club calendar. Pay attention to the divot. Make sure that you get the dates on your calendar so you don't miss stuff. And just remember, everything that we're talking about is for everybody. Right, So if it's a Mother's Day brunch or anything like that, all the golf events, don't worry about your skill level. I keep hearing about skill level. Do not worry about skill level. Just come and have fun. We just had our first event. Everybody had a great time. It was really cool. So kicking some things off here, we're gonna, we might be a little bit late on some of the early May stuff, but then the rest of the stuff we'll really catch up with. And since Lindsay's behind the phone, if I say anything, or behind the camera, anything she says, she's just gonna yell at me. So. We got the men's hole in one coming up. We got Mother's Day brunch. Don't miss it. We're back in action. Okay, back at the club. Things are happening. President's Cup deadline, May fifteenth. Remember what this is. Van plays in it. Everybody plays in it. It's a net best ball event, so your handicap counts, levels the playing field. That's the whole plan there. May sixteenth. I want you to have on your calendars because you're going to be going May sixteenth. May sixteenth. I think that's a Sunday. And what we have that afternoon is we have a huge junior tour event, which is a big fundraiser, and it's kind of the kickoff because COVID canceled the fall seasons. They're trying to get some golf in here in the spring. So we're going to have a bunch of tee times that day. Women's Nine Wine and Dine kicks off this week, and the 18 hole kicks off this week. And then there's kind of a little bit of a week off on the Thursday for the men's hole in one, and then they pick right back up. Look at your emails contact Barb Stolper. She's going to give you all the information you need. Darlene Broadbeck, Julie Nedham running things for us. It's going to be a great year. The calendars are out. Make sure you're participating in all that stuff. The women's opener, May 18th. This is a fun one. Golf event, dinner, everything like that. Check the calendar for the times and different things. We're also going to be introducing a couple of shotguns this year so that we can add some fun things. Wellness week, Lessons with the pro, different things like that. We haven't been able to do shotguns because of COVID and social distancing and all that. So most of the time here, we're going to be doing tea times. But every once in a while, we're going to sprinkle in the shotguns. So make sure you're paying attention to the times. May 22nd, Women's Wampum Cup deadline. Make sure you call the shop. Look at the website. See the description of all the events. See if you like it, don't like it. Look, participation is just what we always look for here. Again, don't be worried about your skill level. You know, from there, Wing Wednesday is back. So every Wednesday we can get those wings. We got our league starting with the men's league on Wednesday night. So we go Tuesday night. Remember when you're thinking about, man, I'm going to go after work and I'm going to play some golf. Remember, Tuesday, nine wine and dine. They'll have that front nine or the back nine there. Wednesday, league night. They'll have the front nine or the back nine. They're going to flip-flop, different things. Thursdays, Wednesday, so on and so forth. Just make sure you're paying attention to the calendar. Make sure you're making reservations for dinner so we know who's coming. Okay, You're going to see extended dining hours. Now, I don't want to tell you exactly what they are. You're going to see something come out via email to so you know when can we get food, when is the kitchen closed. I think you'll be very happy. You're going to see an extra day. You're going to see some extended times. I don't want to steal Chef Todd's thunder, though, because he's got a little communication coming out about those things. So that's May in a nutshell. We went really fast. We spend a lot of time on these calendars. Go ahead, look at them, click on different things, get all the information you want. If you have questions, call the golf shop. My people know what's going on. I promise you. And so they'll be able to answer all the questions. And to all of our new members, just start getting in these things. Get yourself acclimated to what happens. Get to know people. Yeah, get to know people. We got so many great people here that have been here for so long. And, and all of this is going to lead up to the big celebration in July. But first things first, May, May, May. Get yourself registered for all the events. Come on up. Have some dinner with us. Curbside's still going on and everything like that. So we are all systems go. 
It seems as though restrictions are kind of lessening, but that doesn't mean we still can't be responsible for everybody's health. So keep doing all that stuff. We'll see you soon here at Blackhawk. All hands on deck. Go to the website or better yet, call the golf shop one way or the other to get signed up for the things that you want to do. And it's a great way to meet existing members if you are a new member. So for Derek, I'm Van. Thanks for watching this Blackhawk Buzz.